I spoke with Erica Badu's younger sister, Nayrock Udab, who was following close behind in her sister's footsteps with a style of rock all her own. Their mom, Queenie Wright, has been a source of support and encouragement to her daughters from day one and has been very proud to see them fulfilling their childhood dreams. I'm here with Queenie Wright, the mother of Erica Badu and Nayrock Udab, who we just saw a wonderful performance with this, uh, this evening. Your, your family, beautiful family, Thank talented you. family. Can't believe you're the mom. Thank beautiful. Are you sweet? Thank you. Thank you. Listen, tell our viewers about about what's going on with your youngest. This is your youngest daughter. This is my youngest daughter. Okay. An interesting name, Nayrock Udab. Yes, Nayrock Udab. Actually, her name is Corian. She was clever enough to reverse the name, and uh, Korean backwards is May Rock. And uh, I think it's very befitting since she is a rock singer. Yeah. So uh, that, that worked out well. Then. Perfect. And then the last name? Udab is Badu backwards. So it all kind of fit together then. So tell me a little history about your, your, your the upbringing of your daughters. What did you do to get them into this? I mean, they're both so talented. She's more on the rock side. Right. Um, t different styles, mm -hmm. but very talented. Mm -hmm. what, what did you do? Uh, you know with what? Them? I I fed them, <laughs> uh, and and I gave them the opportunity to do right. everything that they wanted to do. I was kind of an unconventional mom in that. Um, they, I mean, they were they were really really wonderful, smart women and I worked all the time. They were wonderful young girls. They ran the household, wrote the checks, paid the bills and wow. everything. So they were very, very responsible. They were very independent mm -hmm. early on. Now just uh, a little bit about um, the, the your upbringing again with your daughters. If, if what would you think that would be a good a, a good way to encourage our youth today, you know, that are on the path or talent? Because we have so many talented even in our city, here from Buffalo, New York, that are uh, trying to make it. What type of advice as a mom, you know, you've been there through some trials, I'm sure, and struggles. Mm -hmm. What would be some advice? Just listen, stay on the path. If you have a parent or a guardian or uh, someone who uh, is there to give you advice, it's very important to listen because they know best. performance was out of this world tonight. I really love your style. <laughs> you have a whole rock thing going on. Right. I just, I'm over here threat doing, I said, whoa! <laughs> That's what I'm here for, well, you know, I'm here to make the people bang. Yeah. Yeah, bang. Now, yeah. you did mention while you were up there on stage that Tina Turner is a big inspiration for you. Yeah, a really big inspiration to me. Um, the reason being is because Tina Turner is like the epitome of women in rock music, you know, right. uh, especially black women in rock music, you know. A lot of times we are, uh, you know, rock has been categorized as a as a white type of music. Right. It's and been stereotype. You know, it's been stereotype, but, uh, you know, it's ours, and yeah. I'm here to reclaim it. I'm here to take it back. <laughs> you did your you know? thing tonight. You did your thing. Now, you did the piece. You closed it out with, um, I mean, I can't even, you, you look, I like so many songs you did tonight. Um, what is the one about it's not, she's not she me? She ain't me. That's, that's, now, is there anything personal with that? No, you no. know, I mean, just, you know, just everyday girl talk, you know. Right. I mean, you know, we're always going through something. With, with we, men. We're always going through something. Right. So, you know. So your, your, your uh, tune here, She Ain't Me. She Ain't Me. Now, you said it's nothing personal with that. It's not personal, nothing personal. It's just, you know, this girlfriend thing, you know. It, was, it started off as a joke between a girlfriend and I. Uh, she was having problems with this guy who was cheating on her and everything. And I was like, girl, don't worry about that. She ain't you. <laughs> and you, you know, said, hey, and, wait a minute. You know, I, and I yeah. really got the pen in the pad. Okay. You know? And it, I know the women, the women did that. The oh yeah, that. definitely. <laughs> we were feeling that one. Now at the end, the other song, um, Higher. Was, was Mo Higher. That's actually our, our ending song. We usually like to leave with that because... Uh, it seems like it might be a little trademark for you. Oh yeah, Mo yeah. Higher. I mean, we, we always trying to get Mo Higher. We always trying to strive for the best, bigger, you know, things. striving for the top. You know, however, I mean, whatever your your level of success is, you know. Right. We're always trying to get above and beyond it. So we trying to get Mo Higher. Right, and also the, I really like the song too that you brought out. You know, what you put out is what you get back. Yeah, the it's universe. The universe. I mean, and that's real. That is. What you put out in the universe, you will get back from the universe. And that's real, you know. And, it's kind of like the old thing that your mom used to tell you, right. what you read yourself. That is true. You know? That and, is so true. And, right. um, you know, putting it to music and, you know, just really 
gives me that communication between music mm -hmm. lovers and you know because I mean no one wants to hear anybody preaching what you put out right. there you know right so music is my I love of. your message your style your flavor you and your sister now I know your sister Erica Badu I know she's got to be such an inspiration for you you're the baby she's, yes. the, she's the big sis yes how what has she been saying to you how has she been inspiring you know what Erica is I mean She's always been supportive of me, as you know, I was supportive to her. But now she understands that this is, you know, I'm, I'm going with a whole new thing and, and rock, and it's it's really nothing like what she does. But she supports it 100%. Right, you right. know, and and we laugh and we joke and we're a little competitive sometimes. But healthy know, competition doesn't hurt oh anything. <laughs> yeah, I mean, because. I'm, I'm praying for the day when I'll be at Erica Badu status. Right. You know? That's right. I'm feeling that. That's coming up. Um, that's coming up. Yes. You guys look so much alike, by the way. Yeah, but, I know. Oh, no. boy. Except for the Randy. <laughs> well, we thank you for no spending problem. time talking to Western New York Magazine, and we look forward to your album. Okay. Can't wait till that gets released. Oh, my goodness. And I'm going to spread the word, because you are spread just it. You're wonderful. It. Thank wonderful. you. They rock, you dive, and seven on soft. Love hard, live hard, rock hard. Always harder. Do everything harder. <laughs>